Hey everyone, I'm Nog and welcome back to Factorio. We are now producing our utility science and that is really great. And we are running a little bit low on uh, copper, I think. We need to produce more uh, copper smelting because if we look here, it's starting to thin out a bit on our copper line. So I think we need to start up a second copper line. Another thing I want to do is start making, uh, if we go in here, I want to start making the, all the different modules, but for that we're going to need copper as well. So the good thing is that we don't need to set up all the uh, mines or miners or anything because we only have one line of copper being produced but we're actually producing enough copper ore to support two lines i think so and we do have two lines going but one of them ends right here right so what we are going to do if did i already set up two lines of copper i did darn it Okay, yeah, so this is a problem. We are not producing enough, uh, whoops, uh, copper, I think. Because even if we get this going out here, it's just not enough to keep up. Hmm. We're going to have to do something about this. And that means going out searching for Another copper patch, I think. And we don't see any at all. Well, we do over here. But in order to get that, we are going to need to fight a crap ton of spiders. And I really don't want to do that right now. We've just been fighting biters for a while. And I don't want to spend another episode doing that right now so what are we going to do what are we going to do I this won't support more lines of, uh, of smelters you can see the ore is flowing along and we're using it up as fast as it's coming in so that's not an option that is not an option. Hmm. All right. So that means that we're going to have to wait a bit for some research to be done, I think. And in the meantime, we can start setting up some... I think we should start setting up some uh, area for that, uh, for those modules anyway so let's do that we need some uh what are they called transport belts conveyor belts and we'll get those from there and we need some machines as well some assemblers where are we making those up there And then we'll run out here and start setting up a bit of machines for our module production. So let's just destroy that. And let's see, how long does it take? It takes 15 seconds to produce a speed module. It takes 30 seconds to produce speed modules 2s. And how long does it take to produce... Threes. 60 seconds so it's double up all the time and we're going to want a lot of modules I think so how are we going to do this so if we let's see if we set up 15 machines for making module ones that was six. 
8, 10, 12, 13, 14, and 15. Research is done. So let's do military 3 because we need military 3 to get to military 4 to be able to get to some of the good stuff. Actually, we could. Let's start by doing the portable fusion reactor. It does take up a lot of space though. So we actually want, we really want Power Armor Mark 2 before we start using that. Yeah, let's do military three and then military four. All right, so what do we need to make speed modules? We need electronic circuit and advanced circuit. And it takes 15 seconds and it needs five. And these fast transport belts can carry 30 items a second. So 15 times five is hmm, 75. So they're going to need a full belt each at least. Actually, they'll. Am I doing this calculation right? So we have 15, which means we'll be producing one a second, which means that we need to be able to supply 15 of these guys, because then we'll be producing one every two seconds of this speed module twos. And one every four seconds of the speed module threes, but we do we really need to go that fast? Let's do so like this with ten. We say speed modules. Then we need Are we will be transporting more than enough, I think. Yeah, more than enough. So we need to say five times 10 is 50 divided by 15 is 37 and a half or something. I can't do math right now. Give me a second, guys. Okay, we're back, and I think I have done the calculations right, I hope. So if we do 10 machines, we should be able to support them on two belts, or one belt of each material. So that should be fine. And then we can run these the other. Actually, I want to run them this way as well. And we'll set up the inputs. Do we need, we don't really need stack inserters for this. We just need fast inserters. Actually, we don't even need fast inserters, I think. But we'll use them anyway. And there, and this doesn't need to go that far. Uh, so here we just need regular inserters. Like that, and then we need some long-handed. And how is the research coming along? Almost done. Very good. And we need some power. And of course, some light so we can see what we're doing. There we go. And then we just need a power pole. And of course, we need to configure them. And that's done. And then we need to hook them up to these guys. There's a lot of stuff in the way for that. Get 
that out of the way so that we can get our belts going. There. And what we need is green and red circuits. So let's get some of those going. Whoops. I want you to come onto that line, but I want that line to go under instead. Like that. That'll work. There, and then we need the green circuits. Which we will get going under. And come out this way. Because I do remember right that it's red and green circuits, right? I hope. Let's see. Yeah, red and green circuits. Alright. So, let's see. Want one of them here? So like that, and we are on the other side of the iron, so that's good. And then we'll just pull this up, and this I guess will be red circuits since we're now. Nah, let's just make this green circuits and put in a splitter. That's green circuits coming in. If we hook it up at least. And we will be producing nowhere near enough green circuits. Look at that. We are getting absolutely no copper or no green circuits. It's ridiculous. We need way more green circuit production. And I mean way more. There. And I think we'll go like that and stick in a splitter and a belt. We are going to need so much more copper. I'm guessing that it's copper that's the problem. Yeah, copper is a major issue right now. Major issue. What we could do, I guess, is... Oh, military research finished. Let's do military four if we can. We cannot. Why can't we do military four? What are we missing? I don't think we're missing anything. What are we missing to make military four? Or research military four? Everything is done. I want to research that. Okay, we can't. Let's research something else that we need for our defense then. What, or what could be the problem with military four? Don't really see what. Hmm. This is a bit weird to me. We're producing all the science packs. Every last one of them. All right, let's do the portable fusion. Actually, let's do logistics system first. Logistics system first. All right, so what we're going to do is we're just going to do like that. Should get our copper flowing a bit faster. I hope. And that'll do it. I don't actually think it will get our copper flowing faster. No, it won't. Because the problem is that we're not producing enough. It's not that we have a bottleneck.
Yeah. Let's just get the line going up. Anyway. And we'll stick this in there and this in there. And keep going. Oops. All right. This won't do us any good right now, but what we really need is more green circuit production. We have produced our first heat modules, so that's good. Let's see, green circuits, what are you missing? Um, has to be copper, right? We're going to have to go do something about that. Going to have to go do something about that. Maybe we... That's red circuits. We have green circuits over here. We're simply using all our green circuits. Oh. We have a bottleneck. We haven't upgraded this. Well, there was at least some that wasn't upgraded. That'll help. Ah, oh, fantastic. Seems like it's flowing along much better now. We do use so many green circuits. I mean, even though it's flowing much, much better, look at the trickle that's coming out. In the end, like one here, one there. We use so many green circuits. But once the blues get backed up a bit, we will not be using as many. But that's only until we start making speed module twos and the efficiency module twos and the Productivity module tools because then we will be using the processing units and yeah, we need a lot more copper and green circuit production. That's just the way it is. It is. All right. So we're going to get that going somehow, but that is going to have to be next time, guys. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe? And I'll see you next time.